What's up guys, Sonny the Badger here. Angie Mama Badger. And this is the video telling you guys all about the apps that you need to use for the world record poker run. Yay! Yay! <laughs> you guys have been asking for it, here it is. Oh, finally. So, so we're running two apps, guys. Um, this is kind of like a double fault system we came up with. So mm -hmm. if one doesn't work, the other one fills in. Because if we don't have the data to turn into what Guinness, then unfortunately you will not be counted in the world record. So we have to have this. So we're going to do everything in our power to get it, but ultimately it's going to fall on you guys to get all the instructions that we give you done. Um, and then everything turned in at the end to us yep. um, to get turned into Guinness. Right, again, two apps that you're gonna be downloading on your phone, and those two apps will have reports that we need to submit. Yes, so um, our first app is Rever. Yay, thank you Rever, we appreciate them yes. coming on board to be the official GPS app for this world record poker run. So what you guys um, will get is, you'll get a card when you get here that gives you a free year of the pro version. But before then, before it. go ahead and download the Rever app. There's a free version. So you can go on the free version, you can play around, you can see all of the features and everything. And then when you get down here, we will get you the code to make it a pro version for free. All right, repeating what I said, go ahead and go from your phone, go ahead and go in and download the app, get the free version of Rever for right now. Rever, R-E-V-E-R. -E -E all the instructions are down below. Um, here on this website page. So the nice thing about Rever is they're setting up a community for us. In that community, we're gonna have the rides. Day one, day two, day three, day four. I literally just loaded them in there. That's what they say. World Record Poker Run day one. So you will click that and it'll give you turn by turn directions for our route for the day that everybody has to take in order to break the world record. And then it'll record that as you write it. Then at the end, we can get that from you guys. Okay, so what I'm gonna do then is I'm gonna download it on my phone and then come July 30th, the first day that we leave from Port Charlotte, Florida, and we're headed to John Maxwell's, I'm gonna log into my app. Yep. I'm gonna find day one. Yep. And I'm gonna click on that. Yep. It's gonna open up into a route and, and it's gonna give me turn by turn instructions. Right, so it'll say take a right here, take a left here, take a right here, go 500 miles this way. Every turn by turn directions directly to Maxwell's. Once you get to Maxwell's, um, you can go wherever you want from there. Um, then the next day you'll do the same thing, part two, and boom, you're off and rolling Okay, again. so it's recording from point A to point B. Yep. So then the next morning I get up, I click on day two. Yes. Hit that day two, it's gonna pull up the route, I'm gonna follow that. Exactly. Okay, all right. Um, pretty those easy, cards, pretty simple. Again, for the pro, is coming to you the day of the event. We have a huge stack of them back here um, that we're ready to hand out to you guys. Be sure to remember your username. And your password. And your password. That's what you're going to need. So if you get logged out of the system, we suggest putting that on your itinerary. That itinerary, that rider packet that we gave you, write that information on there because I'm sure you'll have that with you at all times. Or put it in notes on your phone because you'll have your phone with you. So in your notes section, put Rever login and password there. Um, right. Because we're not going to be able to help you. <laughs> right. We, we can't do anything. Get if we that don't password. Know the it's going to be on you guys to be able to do that. Okay. So that's it for Rever. That's it for Rever. We will have instructions at the very end that's coming soon as to what steps you guys need to take, if any, to be able to get that data to us once we get to Sturgis. Hopefully we're working with Rever. Hopefully they'll just be able to download it to us directly and you won't have to do anything. But we'll let you know. All right, app number two. App number two is called Mile IQ. So Mile IQ, the reason we chose it is it runs all the time in the background. So if you run out, hop in your car and run to the gas station, it records that ride. Um, that's good and bad. So the Rever app, I mean the Rever, sorry, the Mile IQ app is free up to 40 rides per month. All right, let's explain what a ride is. From a start to a stop. So if you go out, get in your car, go a mile and stop, that's one ride. Go 500 miles and stop, that's still one ride. So it's from a start and a stop. 
And let me point out too, your app is on your phone. You take your phone right now and you download it on your phone and you get in your car, not your motorcycle. It's going to track those yes. drives. Okay. It does not matter what vehicle that you're in. If your app is on your phone and running, it's going to record drives. So it counts against your drive total for the month. The fortunate thing for us is we're in two months, one at the end of July, one in August, but it's $5.99 um, for unlimited rides per month. So um, if, you're, if you want to download it now, you're probably going to have to pay $5.99. We recommend um, downloading it the day before the ride. That way it doesn't record your entire trip down to Florida. Mm -hmm. It'll just start recording when you leave um, Florida and go to Sturgis. All right. So 40 free drive per month. Per month. Right. Okay. Now, the, the thing is, is we don't know for sure if you go over those 40, is it going to keep tracking? Uh, I'm imagining it's going to ask you to pay the amount to get your other ride. So it'll probably show you the 40. I'm sure it doesn't stop recording, but they'll probably only give you access to the 40 that right. you Right, so when you go to download, probably it'll say you need yeah. to, to pay for it. You need to upgrade. We're gonna leave that up to you guys. Like we said, it's free for 40 drives, or you can go in and pay the $5.99 a month. So you'd have 40 drives in July and 40 drives in August. The thing you gotta think is in a 500 mile day, you're probably stopping three to four times. So eight times four is 32 if you stop four times a day. But if you leave the hotel and you run down the street and grab a six pack of beer for the night, that's a ride. <laughs> so um, you gotta keep that in mind every time you leave with your phone and you excel past a certain mile per hour, I think it's 10 miles per hour, it counts it as a ride. So keep that in mind, guys. Um, you can go into your app and you can shut off it recording. You. If you do that <laughs> and you don't turn it back on. You need to remember. The, yeah. the, the biggest key I have for everybody here is we have zero control over this, but we have to turn in all of the info to Guinness. If we don't, you don't get the record. So that's my biggest stressor here. You spent a year planning, you've taken time off work, you've spent your money, um, and you we want, want a world you to record. Beat this record. <laughs> you've got to do all of this stuff. And I realize that it's kind of a pain, but it is what it is if we want the record. All right, my LQ is gonna be running in the background at all times, which yes. is our backup, because we want to make sure that you're getting tracked for everything that you do. Right, so That's if we ever had it. a glitch for the day, my IQ, we could be like, oh, here's the my IQ data for that day. Yep. Same thing with um, my IQ. If it didn't work for the day, we have Rever. So the whole point is just to have a double fault system. So hopefully everybody gets counted for the entire ride. All right, instructions are on here as well with the link to go to the App Store or the Google Play Store and download Mile IQ. At the end, there are instructions. Mile IQ is gonna require you to log into your app and follow instructions to get a report a report for the month of July and a report for the month of August. We will have volunteers that will be helping us at the end to explain it to you, but the instructions are here on this website. So bookmark it um, so that you can get back to it and be able to follow those instructions. We'll need your help and your patience while we <laughs> get well, this data from you guys. And, and ultimately guys, getting the data to us, that's on you. Right, we're gonna give you all the directions where to send it and everything, but we, we, we don't have the time or the energy to chase you down to get your data. So if you wanna be part of the world record, then get us your data because we're gonna take all that data, turn it in, and it's probably gonna be six months before we get everything official from Guinness. So the quicker we get your data, the quicker we can turn everything in, the quicker they can start working on it and certify our run. So keep that in mind, guys. Um, you know, we're all adults. Yeah. Send us your data. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Thank you so much for your patience for allowing us to get these two things together because they are so important. And um... yeah, this is probably one of the most important pieces of the entire run. That and as I said, we're going to take pictures of everybody at every poker run stop. That's another big biggie. 
So make sure you get your picture taken at each stop. So we got to turn all this stuff in, guys. Prepare to look pretty. That's right. <laughs> Smile, fix your hair. I don't care what you look like, just as long as you look the same from the beginning to the end so that I can prove that you went on the ride. All right, guys. Most importantly, let's have fun. Let's yes. Let's go beat that record. We'll be here with um, any questions that you guys have. We have our volunteer team. And we look forward to seeing you guys. Hopefully, we'll see you at the kickoff on July 29th. If not, we'll see you bright and early so, um, at 7 a.m. on July 30th, Friday. All right, guys. All right. Have yourself a great day. Have a good one. Bye.